simple to see it said Magic TV So the world can believe it said Magic TV But this guy is a terrific, terrific fighter, great punch taker. You know what I mean? But I don't like the Joe Paluca part of it. You know what I mean? So come on up here, champ. Yeah. The former world champion of the world, soon to be trying for the game. Good afternoon to everyone here. As I'd like to thank God one more time for giving me this opportunity. And of course to Don King for also giving me another opportunity and giving me another opportunity to put food on the table for my family. Le doy mucho respeto a la señora que, que es la, la señora de la manager de la promotora de, de Fernando Vargas, una señora que, que tiene mucho respeto, mi respeto para ella. I mean, my respect to Miss Cassie Dua, an excellent promoter for Mr. Vargas. Bueno, yo quiero que todo el mundo sepa de que en este momento me he enfocado en mi pelea, aunque la gente no lo crea, mucha gente no lo crea, aunque tú no lo creas. Pero ya llevo dos meses y medio de estar entrenando. He goes, I'm very dedicated, I'm very focused, believe it or not, and I know a lot of people are doubting, but I'm very focused, I'm dedicated to win this fight, and although you might not believe it, but I've been training already for about at least two months. Tengo la misma hambre de antes, y yo quiero que tú mires las dos peleas que derroté a seis cabezas y las dos de Bernafore, así como me ven volando golpes, y con esa hambre, con esa hambre voy a entrar para ti. I have the same hunger, the same strength, the same ambition that I had when I first was crowned world champion. I suggest, and I strongly suggest, that you take a look at those fights, because that's the Mallorca you're going to get on September 8th. Yo voy a acabar contigo ya, porque ya tú estás acabado. Lo que voy a hacer es que te firme tu cheque y lo recoge ahí para pensión. Because I'm going to let you, I'm going to give you this one last opportunity for you to be able to collect a, a check. And thereafter, a pension check because I'm going to retire you from boxing. Yo quiero que todo el mundo sepa que el gordo este siempre me ha tenido miedo. Que el gordo este siempre me ha tenido miedo. I'd like to say and I'd like to declare publicly what I've always felt. That fatty over here has always been afraid of me. Parece que la mamá no lo mandó a la escuela. Respeta a la dama que está a tu lado. Apparently, apparently your parents didn't teach you any manners. Respect the lady that's right next to you. El gordo este, cuando yo era campeón 54, el maricón este estaba demandando el consejo que quería mi título, hacía puro regalo. Gánatelo ahora que estoy yo aquí. It was when I was crowned junior middleweight champion by the WBC when I fit, uh, fought Michelle Picciarillo. He goes, you took the cowardly way of trying to get that title by suing the WBC and not stepping up into the ring with me. Now's your time to step up into the ring with me and you have nowhere to go. Voy a hacer la pelea con el gordo en 162 libras porque es el mínimo que el gordo te puede bajar. I'm making and I accept it. And I conceded to take this fight at 162 because Fatty over here couldn't lose any more weight. <laughs> and after this fight at 162, I am going to come back down to 147 pounds and I challenge any of those champions, whether it be Cotto, whether it be Mayweather, or whether it be Sugar Shane Mosley. That's where I want to go, where I was king, and I'll be king again. Y a la vez le hago un favor a tu señora, que te retiro, para que ya no siga llorando cada que te dejan como un monstruo en el ring, maricón. And I'm going to make, and I'm going to make you, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to give your wife a favor, I'm going to do your wife a favor, and not let her cry anymore after they disfigure every time that you go.
Being that you're three times world champion and this fight here, what does it mean to you going in the fight with Vargas now? Siendo que ha sido tres veces campeón mundial, ¿qué significa esta pelea con Fernando Vargas para ti? Bueno, es una pelea muy importante porque eso me, me, da, me abre las puertas una vez más para pelear un título en el mundo. It was a very important fight to me because of the fact that winning this fight, it opens the door for me for another world title shot. Pero no me voy a, a motivar mucho porque yo soy un hombre inteligente y no me voy a engañar solo. Yo sé que Vargas ya no es nadie, por eso no me voy a leer mucho, a ganarle. He goes, I don't have to motivate or pump myself up too much because I've, I know Vargas has nothing left. So um, knowing full well what he has to offer in this fight, I am going to do what I need to do and I'm going to win this fight. Well, you said in, also that in the press conference that you have been training and you're concentrating and you thank Don King for this opportunity. Tell me, what type of training have you been doing and who you've been training with? Mencionaste en la conferencia de prensa que llevas casi dos meses y medio entrenando porque estás concentrado y enfocado en esta pelea. Eh, cuéntanos qué tipo de ejercicio, qué tipo de condición estás haciendo en estos dos últimos dos meses y medio. Eh, aquí tengo presente a mi entrenador, y luego me da igual el básico, correr 35, 45, una hora de vez en cuando, ¿verdad? Y hay que hacer abdominal y los ejercicios generales es una condición, y por la tarde ir al gimnasio y hacer la misma rutina, calentar, golpear samba, hacer sombra, las peras, las abdominales, los ejercicios, y me estoy vitaminando bien, estoy comiendo bien. Voy a rotar, mexicano, dile. For two months, um, I've been training with Mr. Lee Sloan, basically doing the basics in boxing, which is the speed bag, the heavy bag. I've been doing my, my running in the morning, my abdominals, and pretty much calisthenic and, and, and cardiovascular work. But thank you. We do support you here in Los Angeles, and we look forward to Staples Center uh, September 8th. Gracias, gracias Voy a ganar. Que los mexicanos apuesten a mí. Dile que apuesten a mí que voy a ganar yo. I'm going to win and let the Mexican people know in LA to bet with me because I'm the one that's going to win this fight. Thank you. My motivation is, you know, for this fight is pride. You know, my pride won't let me leave, you know, on a defeat. So. I want to make this last fight be my be a victorious and a great one. I've been working since January. He says he's been working since I don't know uh, since when. Two months. Two, two months. months. Two months. Well, I've been working since January. I got him by six and so I got him by six and a half. And you know, then uh, he got up and you know you could talk about my fam, talk about me, you talk about my mom. Everybody knows and being a kid at school and when you bring moms up, that's a no. That's a you know that's a that's a no no. And then, you know, I want to bring, bring up my wife. So I stood up. He want to throw a punch at me. And like I said, I'm a counter puncher. Nine and two, three uppercuts. Got him, out, got him out of there. In Los Angeles, I watch Ed Magic TV. Hi, this is Don King. And I'm watching Ed Magic. What a producer. What a great guy.